If you guys are in need of coins for any reason, make sure to check out Mutt's store. Use code Mike at checkout for 10% off. Guys, I already know what you're thinking right when you clicked on this video. God damn it, Mike. Back at it again with some insane clickbait. But but guys, this, this isn't clickbait. This is true. I've gotten 290 drafts in two attempts. Got it's it's insane. Just just watch the video. So I was approached by one of my subscribers on Twitter. His at is Quinn2A. I'll leave his Twitter in the description. Dude's the real MVP. He let me know about this glitch or strategy. I don't know what you want to call it, but it's pretty freaking insane. Now, obviously, when you do this, you probably want to do it on a Tuesday. It's a lot easier to get 88 and 89 overalls. That's kind of what the baseline is going to be for your basic draft. And then you move players around in your lineup to acquire that 90 overall. So whenever you're drafting your team, you only want to get one player of a certain group of players. It's kind of hard to explain. So for offensive linemen, you really only need one tackle. For offensive linemen, you really only need one guard. You want to fill out your wide receivers and you want to fill out your half back and quarterback as well now on the defense you want to fill out your corners cornerback one and quarterback number two you want to get a safety as a free safety and as a strong safety now the big thing is the linebackers in the defensive lineman you really only need one linebacker and one defensive lineman but you want them to be like one of your highest overall players so like a 98 or a 99 it would be preferable and just so that you guys know obviously the fullback doesn't affect your overall wide receiver number three doesn't affect your overall defensive tackle two doesn't affect your overall uh, quarterback number three doesn't affect your overall and defensive line affects your overall but at a much lower rate and that's the same with offensive line as well so once you get a draft that you are happy with then you're gonna want to follow these very specific steps like I said when I did my first draft I got an 88 overall and I didn't really want to try it I did it again another draft and I got an 89 and I felt like that draft was the draft to use now in this specific situation we are gonna be using Charles Haley you want to use a player that's a pretty high overall at every position possible and what you want to do is you want to put that player as a backup player for the position that you want him to go to. So if you want Charles Haley to play the right outside linebacker and you want to duplicate that card, you put him as the backup player for that position. And whenever you're substituting players, you want to choose the second option every time. Now that you have those steps completed, you want to figure out who Charles Haley's backup player is right now. And in this instance, it would be Derek Morgan. Now you would want to take Derek Morgan and put him as the starting right outside linebacker. Then you're gonna go into the right outside linebacker position. You're gonna go to the backup, which is Charles Haley. You're gonna swap the player. So Derek Morgan is gonna now play backup and Charles Haley is going to be the starter. And as you guys can see, Charles Haley is now the starter for the left outside linebacker and right outside linebacker, increasing my overall to a 90. Now, obviously you guys can see a 90 overall draft. That is insane that you're able to duplicate cards like that. Like when I heard them say, you can duplicate cards, I honestly thought it was a scam. And then he sent me a Twitter picture and I tried it out and it worked it's it's insane now just so that you guys know this was done in play a friend so i actually went and i played my cousin we got in a game but i wanted to see how they would show up like would there actually be two charles haley's on the field so if you go into the depth chart and you look at the left outside linebacker and the right outside linebacker you see charles haley is populated twice but then once you go on the field and you go into your formations you want to click a formation that obviously has both of those positions in there so it would be the four three for me i went in and i looked and they were both not there you had Derek Morgan on one side and then Charles Haley on the other. So long story short, this gets you a 90 overall draft and you get that, that coveted 90. You can finally get your overall as high as possible. But when you actually get into a game, the players aren't duplicated. It's just duplicated in the lineup. Now, honestly, for me, the whole idea of getting a 90 overall draft was just to hit that certain number. I didn't really care about the players that I picked. I mean, I can draft an 87 overall team and it'd be substantially better than a 90 overall team. So that's why the fact that they didn't show up in the game wasn't a huge deal to me I mean this whole thing was just to get that certain number if you know what I mean and I thought okay since I did this in play a friend maybe it's not gonna work in every single section so I actually went into the unranked draft I did a draft I actually got an 88 overall it wasn't an 89 and I thought you know what let me just test it out with this and so I actually went through and did some duplicating on the offensive line I did some on the defensive line and I did some on the linebackers and what do you know we got another 90 overall draft like <laughs> It's insane. So guys, this is the glitch or the strategy or whatever you want to call it to get a 90 overall draft. If you can get an 88 or 89 overall draft on a Tuesday or hell, even not on a Tuesday, you can get a 90 overall draft. It's possible. So now the real question is, can we get a 91? I think that's the real question. So all you YouTubers that are watching this, 
it's okay to put 91 overall in your thumbnail now. You can do that. It's okay. So for all my subscribers, I want you to go online and draft the team and get a 90 overall. Tweet me on Twitter. Let me know what you got because I'd love to check it out. Again, I want to give a shout out to Quinn2A, man. This dude is the real MVP. He sent me this message. I was like, nah, there's no way. And then I hopped online and I was like, bro, what? Like, this is insane. I it's crazy. Definitely check him out. I'll leave his Twitter link in the description. Guys, hopefully you did enjoy this video. If you did, go ahead and drop a like down below. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in my next upload. Peace.